Hey everybody, John Burroughs with Alarm System Store and today I'm here to show and tell you a little bit about a product that we've had on the website for a little while now. We got them in our, like around uh, the middle end of last year and we just want to make you aware of them. They are the System Sensor Smoke and Carbon Monoxide Combination Units and you can get them in either two wire or four wire variety. What this does is it takes a smoke detector and a carbon monoxide detector and combines them into one unit and you also have to have an intermediary module to use these so you will have the smoke and carbon monoxide detectors connected to a module and then the module will connect to your alarm panel i'm going to take you over to the table here and show you a bit about these i've got one wired up so we're going to go over there and check it out so follow me if you will all right folks over here on the right we have the smoke co combo unit and to the left here we have the interface module i'm going to take you over the wiring of these uh, we're going to start over here at the module so i'm going to just do a little zoom in here and what you see on the module are two sets of terminals one on the right one on the left the one on the right connects to your smoke co combo units and the terminal strip on the left will connect to your alarm panel uh, this series the series of leds you see here in the middle uh, those are indicator lights. When it is a normal operation, your top light will be the one, only one on and it will be blinking. The other lights are used for, uh, you know, sussing out like trouble issues or uh, testing purposes. Uh, so those are good indicators to whether you've wired it right or if it's working properly. Uh, the terminal strip on the left here, you see we got the wires attached in. And I'm going to get you a little closer here. What you'll see here is the two power wires for your smoke and CO combo units. You'll have your smoke data wires here and your CO data wires here. Um, just remember that if you're using this on a Honeywell or a DSC, you will have to connect the uh, power wires to something on the board that is going to provide a reset for the smoke and the COs. On a DSC, you will connect these into your PGM outputs on the board and do the programming for a smoke reset. Um, this is a four wire hookup, so you'll have to do programming for a four wire smoke reset. On a Honeywell, Honeywell has advised me that the usual method of connecting smokes into trigger pins, trigger pin 17 for a smoke reset will not work very well with these units. So they do suggest that you use a 4204 relay module for your reset. Um, over here on the right hand side, you will see we have wiring terminals to connect over to your smoke CO combo units. Uh, these two these two spots up here are for your end of line resistors. Uh, I've just got some in here for example, but you will use whatever value of resistor uh, your alarm panel calls for. And um, what we have here, you see where the green and yellow are attached. Those are going to be your normally closed and open or normally closed and common for your um, carbon monoxide detector. And then your black and red are going to be for your power for your smokes and uh, somewhat data wires for those as well. If you're familiar with smoke uh, smoke detector hook to hookups, you know that uh, they have power wire, two wires have power wires and that's it. And then four wires have power wires and two data wires. So these basically act as your power wires and your data wires. Um, the power wires come over here on your first smoke you're going to come in and hook your negative to this post and then you're going to hook your positive to your first positive post in your smoke co combo unit out from there you are going to uh, run your negative to the next negative on the next smoke co and then from your first smoke co you'll come for your positive you'll, to your next one you'll come off the second positive post so you just run them like that. So your second positive post on your first smoke CO to your first positive post on your second CO smoke combo uh, and so on and so forth. And then system sensor has told me that if you're uh, doing more than one smoke CO combo, you will just basically run your wires 
straight to the other terminals on your next smoke CL combo unit. At the very last one in the line, you're going to use this resistor they provide with the module and you'll run it in parallel between the two terminals. You can only fit 12 smoke CO combos per one module. So just keep that in mind. If you've got more than 12 smoke CO combo units, you're gonna have to have two modules or more. Uh, really handy with these smoke CO combo units as the base has all your wiring um, posts and whatnot. So you can just mount them up on the wall or the ceiling and wire them all together. And then after you get done with that, you take your smoke CO heads and they will connect to the little metal loops you saw via these metal pins. So that's where you're gonna get your contact for operation. These are really nice units. We've had people asking about these for quite a while, even before they came out. People just wanted a smoke detector, carbon monoxide detector combo. And we didn't really have anything to offer them until these came along, so we're really happy to have these. If you have any questions, like pre-sale questions, get a hold of our sales staff. If you have technical questions, be sure that you're a customer, choose the tech support option on the phone menu and give the tech at the other end your order number or customer ID and they'll be glad to help you with any questions you have on the hookup of these. All right, thanks guys. All right guys, that's how it's done and that's how it looks. These are really great if you want to slim down your installation uh, by combining, combining two uh, products into one, basically. They do come in two wire and four wire, but keep in mind that they uh, do have to have that module as the intermediary before you hook them to the panel. If you have any questions about this, check out the product description at the link below. And uh, if you want to talk to somebody real, get on the phone. If you've ordered these from us, you can call 888-811-0727. Choose the tech support menu option on the phone menu, and then give the tech the answers on the other end, your order number. They'll be glad to help you out and answer any questions you might have about these. Once again, guys, John Burroughs Alarm System Store. I wish you a great day, and we'll see you soon.